Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy J Mitch. I'm up here today with my Losi Promoted Promoto MX. I want to go over the build with you guys, give you an update on where we stand with the car. If you don't recall, we ran the car previously with this XR10 Pro. There was an issue with running it on 3S. On 2S, we achieved 46 miles an hour with this uh, ESC. Um, but on 3S, the ESC stopped responding and we only topped out at 35 before the ESC went up. After looking at the ESC during the week, figured out the ESC is dead. Maybe it's one of the FETs on the board, but we cannot use this ESC, it no longer works. So um, I'm gonna go and go through and tell you about some updates that we've done and we'll talk about what's in the car now. So a couple of things that we've gotten so far Shout out to XOKRC. He was talking about this 3D printed latch from Fine Fine Designs. Um, so we got one of those in and we put that on. It's perfect. The next thing we did is we had to make room in this uh, battery box seat um, to uh, accommodate a thicker lipo. So what we did is we used some spacers. Um, where did the spacers? Oh, we used some spacers from Hot Racing. Here are the, here's the part number, SPC3007. They're M3 aluminum standoff spacer set. You get a three uh, millimeter, five millimeter, seven millimeter, and nine millimeter height. So right now I'm using the three millimeter heights to keep the seat up. So you, the seat is held with four screws. What I did is we unscrewed all four of the screws and we put the spacer in between the two halves of the, of the car, maybe a little longer screw, screwed it up. And now we have space for a larger LiPo. Now the car, I'm gonna be, I can run a thick 3S LiPo like this. Um, this is a Power Hobbies LiPo and I purchased some, uh, some more 3S LiPos to run in the car. So that those were the seat modifications that we've done to the car. Now, like I said, on the ESC side of the game, I was running the XR10 Pro last week, the ESC Blue. So I was at Adams. Um, well, me and me and me and um, Ted, shout out to Ted. We were talking about uh, other ESC options, and I said, "Hey, we could do this. We could do that. We could do this." So we talked, and we had our mindset on using a Mamba Monster X. But I was a little afraid. I was like, maybe the Mamba X won't fit. So while I was at Adams this last week, I copped the Castle Copperhead. You guys know I'm a Castle guy, man. Y'all know that. I'm always gonna be Castle um, till I die. And you know, I'm not sponsored by Castle, but I am sponsored by Adam from RC Discount. If you looking for anything in this RC game, hit up Adam at RC Discount. As always, his information is in my video description. So Adam said, Jay, I got the Copperhead uh, system for you. It is the ESC with the 3200 KV motor. Well, guess what, guys? You see the box is still sealed. And you hear those beeps, so you know it's a castle in there. So what castle did we fit in there? We fit the Castle Mamba X ESC in this orientation. Um, that's what we're running, the Castle Mamba X ESC. And we also have installed a Castle B-Link. And just so you guys can see, you know, that I'm not playing, I have the B-Link already set up and connected to my uh, phone. You guys see it says Mamba X already. I can see my controller settings. These are all my controller settings. Not really going to get into that, but we're also running a sensor. So we are running the cheat. Uh, option menu and we're doing some things with timing and boost and things like that ted is the mastermind behind all of that and I'm, i've learned quite a lot from him around how the boost timing and the turbo and all that stuff works but when i say this could not have been done with ted without ted i really mean it so shout out to ted man ted understood the assignment before i did he understood what needed to happen i love the car as a little basher had no you know i wanted to be fast it was fast enough for me but you know 
if we talking about speed running, he knows I got problems with speed. He knew it was gonna come out at some point. So that's why we pushed it and that's what we did. So we have the Mamba X ESC and it's the Mamba X is a 6S ESC. It's not just the three or four S ESC. It is a 6S ESC. And we did a couple test runs with that ESC running it censored with this Castle 6400 KV motor. And this, more, and this ESC has pulled over 200 amps easily on 2S and 3S. <clears throat> and heat is not an issue. This motor was an ice box on the runs that we've done. And we did some test runs and we did it at night. So I did not record it uh, because we didn't, you know, we were just tuning, testing and tuning. And it might've made a good video, but it was at night and it was limited space. So, you know, it, it was it was it, it was a little you know, questionable. I don't think it would have been good content. Maybe it would have been, but it might have been too long, you know. And it might have been like a little challenge in editing that video. I'm not the best at video editing. It's something I'm going to have to work on. But yeah, so um, on 2S, this car um, it achieved. Um, I think we did what 47 miles an hour. And then on 3S, it did 53 miles an hour. But we had we didn't have enough space. Again, we were running at night. I was in a small school parking lot. So we had to break. I think this thing has 70, 80 in it all day with this current setup. But we'll see when we, the weather gets, you know, when it stops raining and I can get it to the appropriate spot. Primarily, probably my speed run spot. We'll do a 2S and a 3S run on the car. Um, also, I am running the Castle BEC 2.0 Pro, um, like Earl Moorhead set up in his car. Shout out to Earl Moorhead for everything he's doing with his build. Um, shout, he's 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 making the thing crazy. So um, shout out to him, uh, much success to him. Um, but when I tell you guys this car is a beast, it is a beast. Well, I keep calling the car, it's bike. This bike is a problem, and just to got just so you guys see that it's it's not a game. I'm going to turn it on. When I say it, I mean the the bike. The bike is already on, but I'm turning the radio on. So the radio's on. I'll let it spool up for you guys. Listen to that bad boy spool. And then I'll give you guys, it's a little small 3S in here. It's not fully charged, but I'll give you guys a couple of throttle pulls so you can see that it's fully functioning. That's 3S, guys. Just little blips. I don't want to go too crazy and hurt something. And I'm going to turn the gyro off for you guys. And as it's cooling down, I'm going to give you guys uh, this, you know, I'm in the video. I'm going to say, as always, the full build details are in my video description. If you haven't yet, please line, like, comment, subscribe, leave a super thanks for your man. Um, if you like this content, also, I haven't said it in a while, I do have a Facebook uh, uh, club or a Facebook fan page. If you're interested, all that information is in my video description you can email me if you have questions um jmitch j.mitch.rc at gmail.com if you have any questions you want to talk about any builds you like anything on the channel have questions shoot me an email um i'm accessible there a lot of lots of good information in the video in this video description and all my video descriptions so with that said i'm going to end the video because i talked y'all to death um, so shout out to my homie Dave Hubbard, rest in peace. Shout out to Big Willie. Shout out to the homie Ted for all the hours engineering this car. Thank you so much, sir. Uh, shout out to Adam from RC Discount, Jay Mitch's official sponsor. <laughs> Unofficial official sponsor. That's my guy. So many people I have referred to him. So shout out to Adam, shout out to everybody that rocks with him. Shout out to uh, um, Mark and Hector at RC Discount. 
And, um, you know, shout out to my Philly brothers doing it big in YouTube. Shout out to Philly Swords RC. Uh, and I met quite a few, you know, cool Philly guys and, you know, hobbyists in the game. Um, but I want to shout them out. Uh, just thank you. Thanks, everyone. Thank you, everyone, for supporting your man's channel. Uh, stay tuned for some content, some running content on this card. Um, Y'all be good now. Peace. GoPro, stop recording.